Yeah, this is Adam. We're really, really pleased to have him. We've not been able to say much about him because we knew he was going to be on springtime. But we're sure he's going to be an absolute farm favourite. He, uh, he's certainly taken to David. And, um, yeah. Well, we had a little bit of problems with him at the start. Uh, we had to give him a, a little bit of extra milk because Mum didn't have enough. Um, and we've actually got three or four more that are due any time. So we're going to have a lot of alpacas uh, before you know it. The mum is called Barbara and she's a real, uh, a real fixture at Cannon Hall Farm. We've had her for about 10 years. She's about 20 years old. She was actually born in Chile, so she's, she's had a long and varied life. And, and to produce a, a youngster like that out of the blue was a wonderful surprise. We were absolutely amazed. We couldn't believe it. And for her to feed it, mostly, although David did have a, a role to play in that, didn't well, you? Well, she fed it brilliantly in the beginning, but then I had to step in because she must have just run out of milk. Uh, we've given her extra feed to, to boost, you know, the, the, the milk supply. Uh, but I had a few problems. I had to wear a coat when I went in there because she'd spit at me. And the spit smelled awful. It smelled like sick. Yeah, it's a good job I know how to wash, you know. My washer did lots of extra loads because of that alpaca. I mean, to say she's 20 years old, she's in phenomenal condition. She's in really good body condition. But obviously the milk supply as they get older gets a little bit less and a little bit less and really if she'd, if she'd sort of retire from breeding now that would be wonderful. She'd go out at the top, uh, we'd still keep her as a, as a, as a pet animal, she's, she's an absolute farm favourite and we couldn't be happier to have her. So Barbara, well done. I hope you really enjoyed springtime on the farm and I hope you enjoyed our video too so don't forget to like and share and uh, we've got some great footage all week so tune in. Between 8 and 9 o'clock, Channel 5, it's going to be brilliant. Please give us a share.